she physically and emotionally? Um, Eliza was fine. Clark. Uh, <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, no, no. Um, yeah, no, uh, she's, she's pretty messed up over the Mount Weather and, um, you know, she obviously left because she wasn't able to face her demons, um, wasn't able to deal with what she's done. So she's um, in a state of just sort of like pure survival mode. She's, um, she's just out in the woods, like it's all about, you know, hunting and finding somewhere dry to sleep and, you know, um, just trying to survive. What what do you think at this point it would take for her to be able to kind of find any element of peace to what she's had to do to save the people she cares about? I think it's going to be a long and hard journey. Um, she's not... <laughs> there we go. <laughs> um, yeah, she's in a, uh, in a pretty dark place, so I think it's going to take a lot of time for her to kind of forgive herself and probably for other people to forgive her as well. The rolling. <laughs> oh yes, we didn't want that to get released, did we? Um, yeah, well, I mean, you know, she's obviously in a state where she, in a place where she has to blend in to kind of be accepted um, by the grounder. So um, she kind of goes all out <laughs> with the grounder get up, which is really cool. It's been so fun for me putting on all these crazy cool costumes. She's really isolated. Yeah, I don't think she knows what's going on in Arcadia. Um, yeah, she like that's been really interesting for me this season because I used to be just so involved heavily in what exactly was going on, and now I'm just like, what's up? <laughs> what's happening, guys? Um, which is kind of cool. I've really been enjoying being on my own little journey. If she's so isolated, who are you getting to play off of? <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm with the Grounders, yeah. And we've, we've brought in some amazing, like, guest actors, like um, Zach McGowan joined the cast and Brenda Strong. Um, so I've kind of, yeah, been interrupting with, like, a lot of guest stars and um, it's been different but great. Can you yeah, tease yeah. to see, um, since you're with the Grounders, can you expect to see you maybe reunite with Lexi and see? Yeah, I think it's pr pretty safe to say since she's coming back that I'll be uh, I'll be seeing her. But it's um it's not going to be fun for Clark at all. I think she's she's really torn up about it. I mean, you know, she loved Alexa and she was betrayed. So I think it's um it's going to be a pretty shaky reunion. Do you think it's something that she could ever get past? Um, I mean, I think it is. I think it's something that she could potentially. It's Clark. You know, she does have. A good heart. There's a stunt rehearsal. <laughs> um, no one's getting hurt. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, I think um, her uh, her forgiveness will, will, would take a while if it's going to happen at all. <laughs> Can you talk a little bit about you know Clark's a leader and um, the Ice Queen is a leader mm. as well? Kind of. Do they see each other, you know, eye to eye, or? It I wouldn't have thought so. No. <laughs> like kind of how? What's their, you know, as leader to leader, how are they? Um, well, I mean, the Ice Queen is uh, a force to be reckoned with. Um, the Ice Nation have this really bad reputation for not playing by the rules, um, and uh, I suppose in a way Clark doesn't either. So there is kind of that in that way that. There's a mutual respect for what they do for their people, but um, but she's not the nicest person. <laughs> You'll see. <laughs> um, Clark and Bellamy have such an amazing friendship, and being co-leaders together was mm. so great to see them kind of establish that. Mm. So again, I hope to see them work together again and see what's working out here. Not that I'm aware of. Um, I mean, their relationship has definitely been strained by her abandoning him at the end of season two. And I think Bellamy's going to be... <laughs> cut, guys. Um, they're going to be really um, disappointed in her and kind of heartbroken that she disappeared. 
Um, so I don't know. I don't really know how that reunion would go down. He understands why she did what she did, but I don't think he's all that happy about it. How about a reunion between Clark and her mom? Like, I'd love to see that. I'd love to see Abby and Clark reunite because they, I mean, A, I love working with Paige. B, I mean, I, I feel like our on-screen dynamic's really good. And, um, and I think Abby's like one of the only people left who, who doesn't like judge her for what she did. So, and like he finally treats her as like an adult. And, you know, they've just come through so much together that I really want to see those two back in the same room. <laughs> so you're saying that in the first half of the season that she's not back with any of I'm the not. people? I'm, I'm doing my own thing. Yeah, which is cool.